The judge heard testimony today that may shed light on why Bloomfield Hills attorney was shot in his own home. Testimony came from one of the men police say is responsible. He talked about what he says really happened that night. 7 Action News reporter Anu Prakash is live now to tell us about the star witness for the prosecution. Anu. Well, Joanne, his name is Christopher Hernandez Montiel, and in exchange for his testimony, prosecutors dropped the charges against him, all except for one, and that is conspiracy to commit second degree home invasion. Here's what he said in court. Christopher Hernandez Montiel takes a stand as the prosecution star witness testifying about the night Bloomfield Hills attorney David Zacks was shot during a botched home invasion. Hernandez Montiel says it all started when he got a call the night of April 30th from Devon Miller, someone he calls an associate. He told me he had a he had a job, you know, just uh, basically he wanted me to drive him somewhere. Was there a fee you were going to get, a payment you were going to get for driving him? Gas money. From there, he says they picked up Henry Williams and Cassandra Shabbat and went to Burlington Coat Factory, where he says Miller went and bought two pairs of gloves. There was talk in the car about going to a man's house. Police say it was the home of attorney David Zacks, a place Shabbat had been to before, but her connection to Zacks hasn't been revealed. She knew where the combination or the, the safes were, and she had the combinations. Did she provide any information as to whether or not the person was going to be home or not? Yes, she said he wasn't supposed to be home. He then testified Shabbat and Miller tried to get into the house, but realized someone was home, so they all drove to Detroit, got a gun, and went back to the house. Once they got there, he testified the other three defendants got out of the car. Moments later, he heard gunfire. The other three ran back to the car. Police say it was Devon Miller who pretended to be a cop and ended up firing through the front door. David Zacks was on the other side, just feet away. His son Jeremy was home at the time. I immediately hear my stepmother, you know, crying for my name. I ran up the stairs where I saw my father on the floor um, shot. He was shot in his upper thigh. And where else? Um, he was shot three times in his abdomen region. Hernandez Montiel later testified Miller fired because no one answered the door at the Zach's home, and he got mad. Defense attorneys pressed Hernandez Montiel about his motives for his testimony. You're up here testifying because you're trying to help yourself and save yourself, correct? I'm trying to get out of here because I want to get back to my son and my life. Defendants have been bound over for trial. As for David Zacks, we understand that he is still recovering from his injuries. No word on his condition or if he has been released from the hospital. Live in Bloomfield Hills tonight, Anu Prakash, 7 Action News.